The Portland Trail Blazers 6-5 are coming off a 98-97 home loss to the Memphis Grizzlies on Tuesday night after C.J. McCollum's potential game winner was just short as time expired. McCollum did have the hot hand though on Tuesday, scoring a season-high 36 points. Portland has been involved in some very close games so far in the early going this season. Five of the Trail Blazers games have been decided by five points or less, while the Utah game went to overtime. Portland has had two days of practice to move past the loss to Memphis and focus its attention on the Brooklyn Nets 4-7. It will be game number four of the Nets' five-game road trip as Brooklyn faces Portland on Friday night. On Tuesday, the Nets lost to the Denver Nuggets, 112-104. In the loss, Tyler Zeller scored a team-high 21 points off the bench and D'Angelo Russell added 12 points and 6 assists. Of course, the big storyline of Friday's contest is that the game marks the return of former trailblazer Alan Crabb. Through 11 games, Crabb is averaging 11.1 points and 3.6 rebounds. He has also posted two 20-point games so far this season. As for the injury reports, the Blazers are still without Myers Leonard right ankle sprain and Alpha Rao Kaminu right ankle sprain. The Nets are reporting that Trevor Booker sore lower back and Rondé Hollis Jefferson right hip contusion are listed as questionable. Jarrett Allen left foot strain and Jeremy Lin ruptured patella tendon right knee are both out. The Blazers have won seven of the last eight games against the Nets since the 2013-14 season. Our Dan Sheldon, Dwight James, and Orlando Williams will help set the stage for Tuesday's Blazers and Nets game with Rip City Live on NBC Sports Northwest starting at 600 p.m.